Saturday's Body Count Lottery rounded out to a solid and sturdy 30. 10 out of Haywood. Thanks to unabated gang wars. One officer down, so I guess you're all screwed. Because the NCPD will not let that go. Got another blackout in Santo Domingo. Netrunners are at it again, poking holes in the power grid. While over in Westbrook, trauma teams scraping cyber psycho victims off the pavement. And in Pacifica, well, Pacifica is still Pacifica. This has been your man, Stan. Join me for another day in our city of dreams. Woo, city of dreams, here I come. I bet it's not going to be glitchy on my game whatsoever. Hello there, I'm Nigel Welcome to a new series, Cyberpunk 2077. Uh, so, uh, first things off. Uh, it's been <laughs> quite a while since I have recorded anything. It's been a semester. So, I am back to my uh, timid and uh, scared self. I don't know how to make videos anymore. True, I let's be honest. It's been a while since I haven't made a video. So <laughs> here I am, and my beard has grown. My hair has grown. I'm a completely new person <laughs> from the uh, from the last video that I will upload on YouTube right now. So, this is Cyberpunk 2077. I've been fangirling this game for almost a decade since since the first trailer release. And uh, I have not been living under a rock. I have seen news about it, about it being a disappointment because of the glitches and bugs and all of these horrible, horrible stuff that, uh, honestly, it shouldn't have happened to this game. They they needed to delay it a little bit further. <laughs> Even though I'm uh, upset about saying that, they needed to work on the bugs. But uh, here I am. Uh, let's continue. Goddamn, the volume is too loud. I'm gonna change it. Alright, so... It's been five days since I haven't played this game since it came out. But I have gone through the character creation to save me some time. So, let's get right on a new game on very hard mode. <laughs> oh, buckle up for a serious challenge. Careful character development and clever use of items, game mechanics, and environment will be necessary to help thee make it on the streets of Night City. It's my city! <laughs> it's called Night City, so... Uh, you know, a night... Jamil... Uh, night City? Night? You know? Yes? No? Oh. <laughs> so, CD Projekt Red wasn't thinking about, about me when they did that? Oh, okay. Now I'm sad. <laughs> Very hard. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, okay, th this is uh, where I'm going to explain myself a little bit here, but... Wow, it's already been five minutes of my rambling. Okay, so... I'm going to be super critical with this game because I've been fangirling the game for a very long time, but it seems like the game is... A lot of people are saying that the game is a disaster. Uh, mainly on consoles. On PS4, last gen, I think. I think it was last gen. But on PC, it's actually better. But, uh, it's not necessarily, uh, good in the aspects of, hey, there's no bugs, there's going to be bugs in this game. Probably, hopefully not. But I am playing this on PC. Anyways, here we go. Corpo. Few leave the corporate world with their lives. Few are still with their souls intact. You've been there. You've seen bent the rules, exploited streets, and weaponized information. There's no such thing as a fair game. Only winners and losers. Uh, that's, uh... If you want action, I guess you could go to Corpo, because... Whew, street Kid. 
They say if you wanna understand the streets, you gotta live them. Gangs, fixers, dolls, small time pushers. You were raised by them all. Down here, the law of the jungle dictates the weak serve the strong. The only law in Night City, Night City, <laughs> you have yet to break. All right, this is for. Okay, I'm going to base my opinions because I haven't played this game yet. I mean, I played the game like three hours on the character creation, but not the game. <laughs> yeah, so I spent three hours on character creation. So what? So what? What if I'm not going to see my character? Ever because it's a first first person shooter. What? So what? <laughs> I wanted to play the game at least the character creation. Okay. And then we got the nomad. Roaming the badlands, looting scrapyards, raiding fuel depots. Life on the road wasn't easy. But growing up in a nomad clan has its perks. Honesty, integrity, and love of freedom qualities that few in Night City possess, and no amount of money can buy. Okay, so, <clears throat> here, here's my, I decided my life path a long time ago, a long time ago, and I'm going with Nomad. I'm going to tell you my reasonings. Why? Because I, I would love to play Street Kid or Corpo on my second and third playthrough, but for the first playthrough, I really, really, really want the Nomad Path because you're new to Night City. You're an outsider. You you actually go into Night City from the outside and learn about it. Like, you don't know almost nothing about Night City. Uh, Night City's uh, inner uh, society, inner gangs. Uh, corpos, I mean, nomads and corpos are enemies, but aside from that, I really want the experience that I'm new. I really want the experience that I don't know what the hell on uh, uh, things are going to turn out for me because I don't know anything about them. So I'm going with the nomad life path. Anyways, I was not joking, by the way. <laughs> I was not joking when I said I had three hours of Steam gameplay. So, uh, <laughs> I already made, I don't know if you can see this or not. I already made, no, you cannot, oh, you can. Uh, not, not HD, highly detailed on the camera, but I have done my three hours. I have, <laughs> I have uh, pictured the presets and the numbers of the character that I'm going with so I can make it like this faster even though I'm already 10 minutes talking into the video. So here we go. Uh, female because <laughs> why not? I want to see some girl on girl action on those romances if you know what I mean. <laughs> this is a bit funny. <laughs> this is a, look at like <laughs> obviously the character creation is a bit more modular than your normal games. What do I mean by that? <laughs> well... I'm V. <laughs> I'm V. That's normal, but... I'm V. Get to the... <laughs> then I get to change it and V has to... Deep, v. deep voice I'm all v. of a sudden. <laughs> he has a deep voice all of a sudden and I... That, was, that, that one caught me off guard. That was pretty damn nice. And if I change it to... <laughs> The other one. <laughs> Guess what happens if I change? I'm V. Oh, oh man. I'm V. <laughs> I'm V. <laughs> oh my goodness. That that caught me off guard. Like, <laughs> well, first off, straight out of the bat. And yeah, <laughs> let me get my giggles out. Straight out of the bat. The character creation is disappointing. Uh, first, because it's a first-person shooter and there's no cutscenes. So, why am I going to make a character if I'm not even going to see my character? You know what I mean? That's one of the things that I always say about games. Like, 
if you're going to make uh, the game playable from a first-person perspective only, and no cutscenes, no third-person, don't even make a character creation. Don't even make it. it. It's not worth it. For me, it's not even worth it. I don't care about the immersion. Sure, you you get a first-person perspective of what you're doing and stuff, but personally for me, I have no problems with third-person games being immersive for me. I have no problems with that. And I get to see my character, uh, created character. So, so that's a big minus that I have on Cyberpunk game. Like, don't even, don't even include a character creation if you're not even going to see your character. Also, uh, compared to the trailers and the E3 gameplays and whatnot, the character creation is the interface for it is disappointing. It, it really doesn't look uh, super colorful and uh, all these uh, awesome interfaces that the trailer had, at least for me, they don't have it anymore. They cut back, just by looking at this, they cut back a lot. So. That's my first disappointment, but here we go. Uh, oh, oh no, reconnect controller. Oh, <laughs> I'm V. <laughs> okay, I'm v. stop joking around. Okay, so I got my presets on my phone here, so I already know what to do. I think so. Yeah, the color, the color scheme. Uh, I don't know very well because it's not numbers, but here we go. Uh -huh, for and you can see my character created character and I'm not even going to see it <laughs> uh, except in mirrors but psh, who cares who cares about looking in a mirror who cares about that okay hair color eyes uh 14 by the way I told you I was not joking I spent like three hours making this character that I'm not going to see ever so, you know, just to play the game a little bit, even though it's you, this is not the game per se. This is just like a this uh, this for me is like a like a side activity before you start the game. That doesn't matter. Yeah, that's what I think. <laughs> okay, eyebrows. It was one. This was uh, brown because if it's black, it's way too defined. Uh, let's see, Nose. Oh yeah, if you didn't know, this game is not for kids. This is a game for uh, 18 and above or whatever your country thinks of you as an adult. So, you're gonna see what I mean. I'm gonna blur it, but you're gonna see what I mean soon. Very, very soon. I'm almost there. Just wait a moment. <laughs> Ears. Uh, 14, that's fine. Cyberware. 1. I like that cyberware a lot. Facial scars. 0. Facial tattoos. Piercings. 0. Uh, teeth. 0. Obviously, I'm not gonna go with silver, gold, or copper, or hot pink. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Even though I'm not gonna see my character, but whatever. Leave me alone. Okay, uh, let's see, makeup, seven, by the way, if you didn't have noticed until now, I would, I tried my darnest, I tried my very, very best trying to make the female V from the trailers. I don't know how I did, you can tell me how I did, but, uh, for me, she looks good and uh, it has a little uh, me spin on it. You know, it has a little bit of me in the character creator. So I'm satisfied. I'm satisfied with that. Uh, blemishes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I told you, this is not a game for kids. There is nudity everywhere. 
I mean, not everywhere, but you get what I mean. Uh, this is definitely, definitely not <laughs> for a younger, immature audience. Even though I'm gonna put her breast uh, as big as possible. <laughs> but that's just personal, personal uh, fling to it. So, here's where I have trouble with the nails. I have no freaking clue what to put because I don't have a zoom in on the nails and people have told me that the nails are probably the most important thing you can customize in here because you actually get to see your hands in first person <laughs> so I don't know if I if I screw up I'll make another V again I guess but so far this is not black and this is green and I want black nails but this has gold panther in it and this has gold with red and this has flaming hot rod paint which I got. So this is the part where I don't know what to choose. Oh, uh, gonna... gonna... and let's go with this one. If I screw up, well, well, too bad. I gotta, I gotta make another V if I screw up. Chest, small, no. Default, no. Big. <laughs> you cannot see it, but uh, they're big. <laughs> it's just personal preference. Leave me alone. <laughs> okay, so body tattoos, body scars, zero genitals. <laughs> I have three flavors, a vagina, a penis one, or a penis two. <laughs> Do I want a penis big, a small penis, or a default penis? <laughs> uh, yeah, this is cyberpunk. So, I don't know what off means. I don't know what it means. But uh, I'm gonna put it... Vagina? Or off? I have no idea what the genital part off means. Does that mean I don't have any sex or I mean gender is the same or whatever. Uh, I don't know. But I'm gonna go with the... Uh, I don't know. I mean I want to romance people so... Vagina, I think. All right, enough about the character creator that I'm never going to see ever again. <laughs> this is the uh, the attribute system over here. Ah, I forgot how to do this. Okay, uh, intelligence over here, reflexes, technical ability. No, let's make it equal. A little bit equal. I get whoa. Okay. Five, uh, let's put it cool over here because this is for physical attributes, this is for uh, hacking and, you know, intelligence stuff, which I want because I really want to hack. Reflexes, evasion, critical hit chance, and mantis blades, which I really want. <laughs> I really want those mantis blades. Technical abilities like an engineer kind of thing and cool is for sneaking, for resistances apparently, stealth damage and whatnot. So this is my character. Oh wait a moment, wait a moment. No, I forgot. I changed the jaw to uh, ten. Yeah, there you go. This looks a little bit like the V that I wanted on the trailers. It's not picture perfect, but uh, she looks great. She looks very, very good. All right, and uh, that's it. It's been 20 minutes since I started this game. So this first episode is going to be a long one. So I'm going to finish the video over here and make another video so I get track of time and make this video a whole lot longer than it's supposed to be, like an hour long. But uh, character creator and my rambling aside, yeah, there you go. <laughs> I told you, I, 
I haven't been recording for uh, a whole semester, so I'm a little bit off my game. So, yep, I'll be right back. Alright, it seems I'm back. <laughs> it seems I'm done with the uh, whole, uh, do you want a, a huge dick or <laughs> on a female body or a masculine voice on a female body? It doesn't matter <laughs> because I'm never going to see this character ever again. <laughs> okay, next. Let's goddamn start this game, shall we? Alright. Nomad, uh-huh, biometric data, alias V, fingerprint, let's do this! Woo! CD Projekt Red make me happy, please <laughs> let me not run into bugs, or crashes, or whatever. <laughs> so here we go. Let's see if my computer can actually handle this. Let's see. I have a 1080 uh, uh, GTX GeForce, by the way, so I'm not so sure. Oh! Oh god. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. You can't do that right now? Oh god, no. Uh, oh, okay. Oh. Woo! I uh, already ran into a problem. Uh, the FPS on this is uh, not great. So uh, I need to change some things. God damn it. Uh, uh, it's a little bit better, I guess, but hey, there's my character. I can actually see her. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, so far so good. Oh, oh, mama. That's a strong woman. Okay, remove patch. What patch? I don't see a patch. Excuse me? <laughs> Ex Electric coupling module. Whoa! It was nothing serious when I came in. You said you were sure. Uh, I ran into a bug. All ready. God damn it! That was. I was like, where? What patch? <laughs> we're off to a great start. Uh, lower than 60 FPS, but that's maybe because I'm recording the damn game without a, a capture card, but. Here we go. Welcome to Cyberpunk 2077. I ran into my first glitch. Thank you for having me. <laughs> uh, first time in Night City? Pay close attention to the tutorials to learn more about the basic mechanics of the game. Or if you're already experienced edge runner, feel free to disable hints. Go to the database at any time, blah blah blah. Okay. Guess I gotta... I was wrong. Can always look for another shop. Where they won't ask a lone nomad while she's hugging the border. Uh, okay. Oh, this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. I I like the graphics, even though I You're wearing turned on them. my patience now. Yeah, shush. I turned them down for ugh. Okay, check engine, step aside, I'll handle it. I'm going to pay you what we agreed. Can I check the engine? <laughs> I'm jumping for joy. Okay, that's not the button. <laughs> you know, I don't have all day. Step aside. Uh, step what? aside. Step aside. Got I got any it. idea what to do? Uh. Uh. Hot wire. I'll bypass the couple. I'll bypass the coupling and rig a hot wire. Oh uh, yeah. Run on and on. It could seize up. The uh the sounds are. Uh, did anyone ask your opinion? Am I going straight for the uh, <laughs> the E3 trailer? I've seen this before, by the way. Oh, now I get to see some FPS, but... Oof. Oh. What did I do? Oh, this is the menu. 
crafting inventory map character journal inventory she looks cool by the way but I already ran into a bug so uh, I got a revolver dr5 Nova pretty awesome name uh, V's vest without Becker's patch <laughs> I only had this at the beginning I swear I'm not crazy uh, tattered crop top uh, nomad pants, nomad shoes, nothing special about me. <laughs> so, here we go. I'm gonna disable motion. Uh, motion blur. It's off. Why does it feel like it's on? Depth of field. Uh, slightly distorting lights on the screen. Fear. You know, I don't know how to make it better. But... It looks great. I mean, it could be better if I wasn't recording, but I need to record to, you know. <laughs> okay, so first things. Are, oh, disinfectant. Okay, I haven't seen the inventory in this game much, so this is a new experience for me. Oh, cards. Great. I'm <laughs> I'm stealing everything from here. The Unification War of Gonks. What the hell is it? Whoa! That is pretty cool. Oh god. I'm gonna scroll through this because I already... You know... Spent like... 20 minutes or so. So... Okay, I got that. I can read it at any time I want. What is this? Max Doc Mark 1. Instantly reach stores 40% health. Great. What is what use? Uh, messages. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna look through this guy's uh, PC. You're a winner. Uh, how do I scroll? Ah, there you go. Congratulations, greetings, user. Due to uh, continue the use of Kino. Kinoshi services, you were entered to the raffle and then be selected for one prize. <laughs> Kinoshi Thermosense 9873. Reply to this email in the next 10 minutes to claim your prize. Hurry up or another lucky user will be seeing you in the world of Thermal Vision ahead of you. The Kinoshi team. Alright. What is this? Alert, you've been attacked already. <laughs> Malware detected. Your computer has been attacked by three demons. Our system detected two attempts to obtain your personal data. One attempt to corrupt your neural processor. Well, that's bad. Uh, immediate action required. Our quick tra threat neutralization software can prevent identity theft of the implant hijacking. Remember, hostile net runners can infiltrate your nervous system and force you to commit terrible crimes such as uh, fraudulent bank transfers, assault, thefts, or an or armed robbery, suicide. To protect yourself, click the scan now button for the sophisticated anti-daemon software will eliminate all threats immediately. Wow, if you do not <laughs> scan in the next 5 minutes, 17 seconds, your operating system may suffer in very reversible damage. Protect yourself now. Well, I don't think nomads have that kind of money anyways. Attention, Mega Medicine Lottery. <laughs> Buy two tickets, get the third one for free. <laughs> Thousands of prices are still available. Drugs, reanimators. Primary care appointments, surgery vouchers, blood screens, cyberpsychosis, vaccines, reproductive referentials, and our grand prize, a one-year trauma team premium package. <laughs> Hurry while supplies last. Your neighbors already have their tickets. Buy yours now. Alright, files, one, shop inventory, parts purchase acquired by alternate methods last month. Spark plugs, crankberries, oil pan, oil filter, oil pump, ignition coil. Starter, ECU module, timing chain. All right, net. Oh, what is this? Oh, so there is a uh, internet, but it's actually a local uh, service. Huh, pretty cool. All right, what's this? Tiancha Pomelo applies a. Hit hydration status, which increases my stamina by ah. Oh, so it's a drink. Let's drink it. Ah, oh, I don't even get to see my animation of drinking it. Oh god damn it! All right. Uh, 
Can I? Ah, uh, it's it doesn't snap to the character when I do this. Ah, uh, come, come on, CD Projekt Red, come on! I wanted this game to be super awesome, but already I see a lot of cuts. All right, get it. I'm not gonna be rude. I'm jumping for joy. <laughs> let's get it. Okay, let's see what happens. The sound is amazingly. Oh, I have a dog. <laughs> that's uh, that's so nice. Okay, uh, start engine. I guess. Let's go. It's like I was telling you. What were you telling me? Uh. I'm gonna. I'm gonna ignore you a little bit because I know this starts. <laughs> Whoa! Not shabby at all. Questions: How long it'll last you? Uh, it'll get me to Night City. I'll figure something else out there. Right. Hopefully. Uh, I'm looking for Jackie Wells. I'm looking for someone. Jackie Wells. Maybe, maybe. No, <laughs> you don't say anything. Uh, doable. Doable. So doable. Sure was. <laughs> Satisfying that. Not a solid fix. Might as well have used spit and duct tape. It worked. That's what matters. Well, V... You cannot really <laughs> expect the car to run when it's already... You know, if you're gonna hijack... Uh, bypass... No, I don't whatever. have all day. Whatever, connect to radio station. <laughs> Let's see here. Mm. Antenna on this heap don't seem like it packs a punch. Already hate Not the nails. To hear much. You don't say. No, don't say. I'm gonna change the nails later. Uh oh, sheriff. Hey, Mike. Didn't know you had a customer. Uh, rolled in a, a few hours past. I, I thought she'd at least called in to you. Don't you sweat it, Mike. We're gonna hash it out. Ah, uh, you're the uh, sheriff around this buzz, aren't you? Don't you know you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. Uh, um, okay, my mistake. My mistake? My mistake. I hadn't I'm planned bad. on stopping. A failed coupling forced my hand. <laughs> yeah, always some failure high mistakes. It's true, I swear. Name's Andrew Jones. Probably heard of me. No. Good enough. Served in spec ops during the last war. Silver showguns? Ring any bells? Afraid not. I can't say that it does. Don't like to get along, do you? Hey, you told me if I remember you. Oh, you have med packs on your things. Nice. What are you gonna do to my I car? Have no oh. mad vehicle. Might have expected that. You gotta get your food out of there because uh, I don't appreciate that. Uh, I'll just fix it and be on my way. I'll be out of your hair. I'm going to Night City anyway. I'll just fix it up and go. Suddenly I have no reason shy. to linger. <sighs> no, you sure shit don't. What do you mean? Nothing boils my blood like a fucking stray. Where's it's... your clan pitch camp? You me? What do you have against nomads? Are you one of those who believe everything the talking heads say? That nomads are the world's greatest evil? No. I'm a man that respects order. Corpse brought us that order, and I intend for it to stay that the way. The corpse pay you and have you on a leash like a dog, you know that? Mm-hmm. But you don't want to see me bear my fangs. So I'll ask again. Where's your clan? <sighs> I'm here alone. I tore off of my clan patch, I There's guess. There's no clan. There's no camp. I'm here alone. Ain't buying it. Nomads always stick to their packs. Well, maybe My not me. My family's in pieces. That's why I'm headed for Night City. My city. Makes you an outcast among outcasts. That's what sure I want. Sure hope you'll be on your way before long. <coughs> You're a real hospitable punch. I heard this place was famous for its hospitality. Ah, oh, glad to see it wasn't just rumors. <laughs> You're damn right we are. When people come along who know how to behave, Seems like you're not behaving right now. I need to use your radio tower. I saw a broadcasting comms tower on my way in. My antenna's down and I need to radio somewhere. What you need's to hightail it out of here without another word. Ain't got no mind to see you drifting around these parts. Got it? Alright, douche. 
<laughs> you like the sound of your voice, don't you? You like the sound of your voice, don't you? What's that, Drifter? What do you want about? Nothing. Nothing, Nothing at all. Nothing. Yeah. Best that way. All right, hold to get out of the garage. Oh my goodness. Okay, I do not have any control. Oh. Used to drive rigs for sub oil. Lousy stim that was. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Bit it padded your pockets though. Sure, but imagine hauling a tank of rocket fuel across two states. Fuck up once, you leave nothing behind but a crater. Uh. All right. How do I? How do I? Uh, how do I uh, switch camera? Ooh. Oh. Oh, there's my character. <laughs> Look at her right there. Okay. So I'm gonna end this video here. It's not eventful. I know. It's not. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> oh, that's pretty funny. Okay. So. Okay. So. First things first, the graphics look amazing. I like it. Oh, my my timer for the uh, drink is wearing off. Ah, eh, whatever. I'm gonna leave it like this. <laughs> gonna make V do this. <laughs> okay, so, uh, first things first. Nice impression. I already ran into one bug. I already hate my nails. So I'm gonna start over the character creation. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can uh, increase the quality while maintaining 60 FPS for my game. Again, I do not have those uh, scalped uh, 3080s from Nvidia. They sold out because of scalpers. Damn them! <laughs> I was planning on buying it when it first came out, but oh well. Robots got ahead of me. So, uh, yeah, the voice acting, the sounds are, uh, the gameplay, I still haven't played the game, but, uh, like I said, I'm a little bit disappointed that there's no third person because I don't get to see my character, but so far so good, I noticed that there's no snap to the character that I'm trying to talk to, which is a little bit disappointing, but look at this! The quality here is great. The The image quality is great. I don't know about the gameplay quality because I already ran into a bug. So, anyways, I'm gonna end this video here. I'm gonna start it in another one and I'm actually going to play the game this time. <laughs> but I'm going to make a new character because I read that there is absolutely no way to change your hairstyle or nails nail color so i hate the nail color already but i couldn't see the nail color in the character creation because it was all dark so uh yeah so far so good but i'm a little bit skeptical anyways Thank you everybody so much for watching this video, I hope to see you on the next one with real gameplay, <laughs> and have a good night.